Yeah, no doubt the start of the tournament you know, didn't go our way. Um, you know, there were a couple of games there that I thought if we won some bigger moments, you know, we may have got a couple of wins. Yeah, overall, we've come back brilliantly well in Delhi. Uh, I'm, I'm really excited um, for the future. I mean, Tanuja, or TK as we, we call her, she's, um, she's been our most, probably our most consistent player the whole tournament. You know, you know what you're going to get from her every, every single game. She puts in 100%. Um, she bowls some of the hardest overs as well, and, and that's people may not realise. Like, yeah, I mean, Megna's obviously new to the, the team this year. Uh, I wasn't involved last year, but they picked her up in the auction this year, and she's shown she can be a bit versatile as well. Like, she can swing the new ball. She can bowl stump to stump through the middle uh, if required. She's bowled some tough overs at the end, you know, and she's learned from some of the mistakes she's made as well, which is great to see. Yeah, I think um, Hema showed her class in that knock at three. Um, as I mentioned before, she's been up and down the order a little bit and that's been you know whether we want to go right left hander um, and she missed a couple of opportunities when she could have been a three because we started well and she got dropped down the order a little bit and when she got that opportunity to come in a three um, the other night uh, against MI I thought that was just one of the, the best innings I've seen this tournament. Shabnam's the thing that struck me when I first arrived for the camp was her work ethic like she'd bowl you know, a number of overs she'd go to gym she'd go to do her fielding um, and so you can tell she really wants it. Like, you know, she really wants to be you know, one of the best young bowlers in India. And as a head coach, uh, that's all you can ask for. Um, you know, Laura has got us off to some really nice starts after missing the first couple of games. Beth in Delhi has been you know, unbelievable. You know, she's really held that batting line up together. Her leadership, her wicket keeping. Um, Ash has played, you know, we know she's got a big workload. She's bowled four overs, she bats through the middle for us. She's one of our best fielders, so she's running a lot of, you know, making up a lot of ground in the field. So she's a hugely important player for us as well. You know, Phoebe, another one who, who would have loved to have done, I think, better this tournament, but um, that can happen with a young player. And, and she's, she's already a star, but she's going to be a star of the future as well. So, um, you know, there'll be a time where next WPL she comes out and, and, and dominates, I've got no doubt. Yeah, I've been um, pleasantly surprised with, you know, how big the crowds have been. You know the TV coverage, the um, how big it is over here, and it's you know something that's all the players want to be part of. You know, coaching staff and staff want to be part of as well. So, um, you know, I'm really looking forward to if, if, if you know, given another opportunity to come back next year and um, and really see where we can take this group. We've seen some real positives in the second half, and then um, if we can keep taking that momentum into next year and um, maybe building you know, a little bit on our, our player base, then that's going to really help us going forward. Thank you to the Giant Army for all the support. Um, you know, I see what goes out on social media and see all the support that we get. You know, unfortunately we didn't quite make the finals this year, but I think we've seen some really improved performances, both individually and as a collective group. And I've got no doubt if we can keep, you know, majority of this group together, um, it's only going to go up in the years to come.